Hi, my name is Rebecca Davis, and I'm the principal at Valley View Elementary. And I have a book to read today, If I Had Your Vote by Cat in the Hat. If I had your vote, oh, the things I could do, oh, the things I could do with a yes vote from you. If I had your vote, and if I were in charge, I would make a few changes, some small and some large. If I had your vote and a fun, fun, fun staff, and not just a staff, but a staff and a half, I would have my fun staff fill the fridge with fun foods like hot dogs and cakes that make fun feeling moods. If I had your vote, I would really prefer this office to be far more oval -er -er. Thing one and thing two would know just what to do to square up this room and re-oval it through. If I had your vote, I would smile and smile and sit very still for a very long while. The painters would paint me from morning till night to get every inch of my smiler just right. If I had your vote, I would sign all these bills with an ink and a pen made from stick you pine quills. These bills would become laws and those laws with some luck would now and for always stay stickity stuck. If I had your vote, I could be on TV with all of these pointy things pointing at me. I would be in your house. You could all see my face. You could all see my face even way out in space. If I had your vote, I would take all these books and sort them by smell and hook them on hooks so that all you would need is your nose, beak, or snout to sip sniff out a title and check a book out. I wonder what this kind of book is about. If I had your vote, I would paint this whole place, these cases, these vases, and boots and their laces, and all these tall walls with their unfunny faces. But as for this room, I would leave it alone. That hat on his head looks a lot like my own. If I had your vote and these plates and old bowls for fun, I would put them on top of these poles and twirl them and swirl them around and around until they stop spinning and fall to the ground. But no need to panic or worry, you see. The new ones I pick will be perfect for me. If I had your vote, I would meet other leaders who happen like me to be quite messy eaters. Oh, how we would eat. We would eat, 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 eat with our squirks and our flumes and our hands and our feet. If I had your vote, I would plant far more flowers and trim these high hedges for hours and hours. Then shower the flowers with water I take from this splishily, splashy, and fishy free lake. If I had your vote and some almost hatched eggs with shells on top and the bottom half legs, those long-legged eggs would not be a batch of eggs you could catch before they all hatch. If I had your vote, every night in the sky would look like it looks on the 4th of July. Kabooms of all colors like pink, blue, and red would spark up the dark in the sky overhead.
if I had your vote, I could hire a crew, a clean it all crew that would clean this house through. Thing one would wipe windows, thing two would scrub chairs, and little cat A would shampoozle the stairs. Then little cat B all the way to cat Z would sweep every speckle of dirt they could see. With one final touch up from little cat Q, this not so new house would look newer than new. If I had your vote, this is what I would do. The country would love me, I think. How about you? And that's the end of If I Have Your Vote.